In this tutorial, we'll show you how to create a typed text effect in Premiere Pro, like this example. First, select the Type tool and create some text. Select it and go to the Essential Graphics tab. If you don't have such a tab, open the Windows panel and choose the window you need. This window contains all the settings for our text. Let's choose a font that suits our style. Great, looks like a typeface. Here you can change the size and set it to the center of the frame. Now we have a section of video with static text. Go to the Effects tab. Video Effects. Transition. Linear Whip. Double click of the mouse. And go to the Effect Controls tab. Here we will set up this effect. This parameter is responsible for the overlap level. Here we set the angle at which we need to overlap. So that the text closes from left to right. In this case, it is 270 degrees. Now, using the animation keys, create the effect of rolling the text. By moving the keys, we select the optimal speed for opening the text. Fine. Now let's create a cursor. Selecting the rectangle tool dot and draw the cursor. You can change the color here. and then adjust the size. I will set first the layer with the cursor so that it was at the beginning and then the text will go. We put the cursor at the beginning of the text and put the key. And at the end of the text after opening it. This is the effect. View frame by frame for errors. And correct it manually. Now let's add naturalness to our cursor and make it shimmer. There are several ways. Let's take a look at the simplest and fastest. With the shift key and the left arrow key, we switch to 5 frames. And crop the video. Subscribe to our channel not to miss even more training videos. Select every second fragment and delete it. Great, we got the result.
For a complete effect, add sound. I will use a file that I downloaded from one of the free resources on the internet. You can crop, speed up or slow down based on the speed of your animation. We choose the moment where the text appears and adjust the sound. If you need to make changes to the cursor layer, click on it with the right mouse button and choose Nest. This will collect all the selections into one layer. You can also combine the entire effect into one layer for later use in your project. For everyday work, it's easier to use ready-made animation sets. In this case, it is the Essential Typography Library set. From Easy Edit Studio. Here is a large number of templates that you can use in your work and customize in a matter of seconds. Link to this set in the description.